Welcome, Rich Nation, it's AJ, hello. So today, if you guys don't know, we are gonna be breaking down the entire fall season. We're gonna watch uh, as much trailers as we possibly can of them. We're gonna figure out, when I originally looked at this list, originally, I saw, oh God, I don't even know. I saw a, like not much that I uh, recognized, but then I dug through it. Um, I just wanted to see the names and we're gonna break down through these because holy crap, is there some familiar faces in this lineup? This is a remake of uh, of an original show. So I'm gonna tell you my history with the show and what I know about it. So my history with it, back when it when the original first came out, oh God, when like 15 years ago, I I was a kid. Like when I was a kid, my uh, my brother like wanted to watch this. So I watched a couple episodes, and this is where I get the. Uh, for anyone that, I guess this isn't really, for where the anime crazy eyes comes from, I, I was, a, my parents were, didn't really like that type of stuff, and I got, I wasn't allowed to watch any more of it. So, uh, years later, I, you know, it's funny, even like a year ago, I thought about like binging this show. And uh, I never got to it. So now at this point, there's no point in going back to watch that show. Might as well just watch the remake. Though I have a feeling some of you guys might, uh, some of you guys that are super knowledgeable with this might tell me otherwise. Um, but uh, yeah, I, uh, I, I, this is one that I am actually excited about. Uh, I, I'm very excited about. So we're going to go, uh, right now we are going to watch the trailers and the previews. Yeah, they look a lot different. It's been, like I said, it's been a really lot, long time. I just remember, I mean, the animation style, the animation's gonna look a lot different anyway. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, God. The, the Yandere eyes. The Yandere eyes. Oh, boy. Oh, man. I, I can already tell this is gonna be, I, I'm telling you right now, this is gonna be the show. I, I like, oh God. I, I, I'm so glad I didn't go, I, I didn't go back to this. Now I get to be in the freaking dark. Oh man, this is gonna be fun. Here we go. Here we go, boys. So much, yeah. That was the thing about this, is the mystery. Oh, oh God. See, that's the one I remember. Um, suspect everything, suspect everyone. God, I just wonder what to really expect here. I don't trust anybody. Attack on Titan has, has taught me well. Suspect everything, suspect everyone, question everything. Um, oh God. Oh God, no, 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 no. I, I, get ready for, <laughs> that's all I remember as a kid, the crazy eyes. Oh, the scary chibis. I think we need some horror in our lives, guys. Oh, don't go! Oh, God! Oh, God! Oh, God! That just gave me fucking flashbacks! 
I'm telling you, I'm putting the sound up on this one. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm putting the sound up on this one. When If we decide to choose this series weekly, I'm playing the sound so uh, high so I can give get the feel of it to me because that's gonna scare the living shit out of me Fuck. I, if anyone is old school AJ fans horror is not my freaking category I it's, it's not my horror is not my day boys <laughs> so we have as our next one Jujutsu Kaisen when I was looking through this list what made me um be interested in possibly because I saw Mappa and as we saw, we just did, what was it? God of High School was Mappa, right? So uh, we see what Mappa can do. We also have AOT being animated by Mappa. So at least animation wise, we know they have high potential. Now, um, this one is actually decently rated high. So we're gonna go ahead and watch a couple things on here. All right. Toho animation. Is this another horror one? Hold on, I can raise that up just a little bit. Curses. Kind of curses this. The hell is going on over there? House of Curse. I hate this to specify. I see a hammer. I saw. Wait, is that a love hammer? Does she smash faces with love? Whoa. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. That was a. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That was a freaking. That was a finger. That was a finger right there. First of all, that's that's creepy as hell. But we saw a finger. Hold on. Blood, weird creature, people grabbing, and then where'd that finger go? That oh my god, that's a fi yeah, that's a finger. Demon, some type of demon finger. The double faced specter is without a doubt the king of the curses. Okay, there's a lot of dark element shows this season. What the fuck? Are they in the? Uh, they like playing with body. Holy Jesus. They like playing with body parts here? Boy who fights for the right death. Which, what the hell does that mean? I like the mystery and the song was actually pretty, pretty fire. Um, holy shit though. I, I like this because I'm very confused. And when it comes to these, I want to be I, I want to be confused because I know nothing about it. Um, okay, so let's go to trailer two. Oh, they did a good job. I'll give them that. I usually get unlucky with those. What the f fuck is a panda doing there? What the hell? Was that a fall guy? Does this man have the one punch? What is what is going on here? Okay then. Um, <laughs> the I mean, hold on. Uh, we got the you know the the guy that puts his puts the thing over his mouth. That's okay. And then, but I swear to God, I saw. Yeah, we got a fall guy there. What's a what's a fall guy doing in this? Um. Yeah, Jujutsu Kaisen. Okay, let's go to trailer three. That one was relatively short. What? What the f That guy looks There is a there is a lot of interesting characters here. Jesus. Jujutsu. Okay. I'm interested. 
I think that's what we're missing this uh, like we need another fighting a like type anime this looks good and we get to see weird creatures count me in okay so these shows start in two weeks guys this is really interesting now um some of you guys were uh naming this as well to check out um and i i find it i find it relatively i think it's more the visuals it's kind of hard to dissect what i and I, I try not to dig too much into what the that's why i i'll briefly read a summary or something because i don't really or like because it'll have a uh you know a summary of uh what the show is or whatever I, I don't usually like doing that going into a show blind like this we all are going in blind for the most part so that's good um but uh from the visuals it looks like entertaining and interesting and i think we are without you know without my hero without one punch without mob i feel like we are I, we have overlord but without we're missing I, I mean we have one piece we have shows that have some fighting in it but this looks like it's very centered on it and we're i i uh i'm interested now i want to know what you guys think um let me know yay or nay would you want to see like i said we have up to two options this season so would you want to see are you watching this and would you want to see uh yay or nay okay so this is called tony kaku kawaii uh tony kaku kawaii um i know nothing about this one i haven't even heard of this one so don't worry Hmm. Is this oh is this based off a of, Okay. Comedy about a married couple. A boy How old are these guys? What are people getting married when they're 12 now? If you'll marry me, I'll go out with you. The fuck? So it's an anime about a illegal marriage. What is what is going on here? That's uh, maybe their characters are older. I don't know the way they're displayed though. I, there's not much to go off of. That's the only problem. Like maybe there'll be another trailer, possibly a longer one. But there's not like we get the concept. The concept is they you know they get um you know they're ma get married. I guess you can't date unless you get married from this girl's perspective or something. I'm sure there's more to it. Seems more like a slice of life. Maybe some drama, romance. Um. I mean, it seems interesting. I just, I don't know. I can't really get much off that trailer. Let's check out Noble East. Cause, okay, so this one was actually recommended as a, uh, as a reaction for a read through, like a read through reaction. It says, man, Noble East is more geared towards female audience. I guess, I, I guess we, I guess it would change the demographic, <laughs> the demographic of this, <laughs> of this a bit. Who knows? We need variety. Look, I I react I reacted to the openings of a few shows that might not be geared towards myself, right? I am completely fine. I'm going to let you guys know right now. I am completely fine with reacting. I I am open to watching stuff that's not a shonen or like I'll I'll watch shit, get me invested. I'll watch a show that's more centered towards like uh like a uh, a different audience. I it's just more of I, I'm very open to shows. So it's it's more that even if it's not lean towards me, like seriously though, I, I'm not I'm not that guy like me. And if you guys didn't know this already, I'm not that guy that's gonna say I'm only watching fighting anime. I'm only watching fighting anime. If they're not bashing each other in the face, I ain't fucking watching it. I'm not that guy. I'll wa I I can watch I can watch something like Attack on Titan with mystery and craziness. And then go and uh and check out just full fan service boobs and in face like you know what i mean like i can or i can watch a good romance drama i've been wanting something that's gonna make me cry interspecies reviewers you want to check out the patreon if you want to see some of those reactions it, it, uh th that was off of patreon request we are five episodes in so far of that show um uh i uh that made me cry in a different way it made me it made me cry in a corner it, it made me cry all I want, I, I remember watching that show just makes me want to watch. I All I'm doing is I'm waiting for old fashioned boobs and ass. And instead I get like furry, 
every every little thing you could possibly think of in that show, but just good old fashioned boobs and ass. I, I, I that's all I'm wanting. Where's the show? Like, <laughs> I just don't get what I want. <laughs> Oh. Now, what is this about? That's the, the big question. To keep the peace in a supernatural war. What the fuck were those? What are those? Th they keeping bodies and experimenting or something? Is headed to high school. Uh, what happened to the, the creatures and stuff? Huh. The hell is this about? It can't be just about high school. If you notice, like, what's happening, like, there's a bunch of burning down. There was, like, weird bodies here. Like, what the hell is this? This is what was the most intriguing image of this entire thing. These bodies, like, are these clones? Are these, uh, like, it just experiments? Are these real people they're experimenting on? Are they, is this, is this a high tech? land area what the freak is going on um because it goes from that to like it, it says an eternal because it says there's a war there's a supernatural war an internal weapon is headed to high school so we're we're putting some what maybe th this character they're showing is like some type of weapon so you're putting a weapon in high school is that is that what it's talking about he kind of looks robotic a little bit more so just like he's got that main character face the main character blank face like if we're going old school the main character won't talk kind of face uh, <laughs> some people uh, some people are saying to read it i i like watching see the thing about you know the god of high school i'm gonna give you an example we watched the god of high school we got two episodes left it made me want to read it to find out what they missed and what was skipped does that make sense like i feel like watching the anime May, is making me want now i'm gonna do a read through of season one this is a sequel to inuasha and if you guys don't know i watched inuasha i um maybe a year before i started reacting i watched inuasha and uh, binged the crap out of it and i i loved it i love a good ro i love a good romance and fighting like this had a mix of everything and a sequel to it i did not the way the conclusion is I never thought they would do a sequel. This comes out of nowhere to me. I saw that Ranma one half is the bomb. So one of the first animes I ever watched as a as a kid, and uh, it was duh, uh, uh, the dub, was Ranma one half. And if they ever make a remake, I'm watching that because if you've never seen Ranma one half, it's one of those shows where you can literally go into the middle of season five and watch a random episode and not be confused. You can, you're gonna be, con well, you're gonna be confused, but you're not gonna be any more confused than if you watched episode one. Like, you could watch episode one, maybe maybe watch the first couple episodes of the show, and then you could bounce around seasons. It's one of those shows where there, it's like, you can watch anywhere, they're so random. Uh, like, Ronald one half episodes are so random. Now, I, that's a remake I would love. If they're gonna if they're gonna make a sequel to this, they should make a sequel or a remake to Ronald one half. It's, it's by the same person. It's written by the same person, by the way. In Yuasha and Ranma one half. Yeah, these characters look so much this. Oh. Okay, so yeah, that's the original story. Some people were rooting. I know a, a certain somebody in my family that was rooting for Kikyo, but uh, we got good old, uh, I don't know. <laughs> she could say technically they're the same person. <laughs> Except it gained the powers of the Trees of Ages, creating a passage. We already know that from the original, right? And sucked through that passage. So this is... Oh, that's... uh. So that's... Um, freaking... Uh, What's-her-face's bro little brother. Now he's older. Looks like he's in high school or something. So... What? And they have twins? Ten years have passed. Uh, okay, obviously, obviously, couple, uh, daughter of the best people in, in the show. 
So is this all the main characters girls or something in this? Okay, boobs. That looked actually that looked like the same enemy from the beginning of the original show. I'm getting nostalgia all up in this bitch. A feudal fairy tale. I don't know how to feel about this. I'm excited because the nostalgia is like rising right now and anything from like any like I said, if we got a Ronma one half sequel or anything from from them, I I would be interested in. But I just don't know how to feel about it. Like I was getting I'm getting that nostalgia feel and I'm excited, but I also I'm scared because it could be bad as well. That's why I'm like I get but it looks exciting to me like going from just this I it's it feels like the show you know um like what do you what do you guys think are you excited if anyone's a fan of this everybody you can look you can look now um what do you guys think about this see yeah that's the big thing it didn't center on any of the, with the exception of like the kid brother it didn't center on any of the original characters and that's a little scary when you like because that makes it its own show so you, i i can't really judge it without watching it that's i if it was centering on inuasha and it was centering on all these characters uh, on all the characters from the original then yeah i i could judge it a little bit better um but yeah there's a couple anime originals that's okay pa works so PA Works makes some pretty good, but they're always Aniplex normally. But PA Works makes some. Let's uh let's check that one out. Kami Sama Ninata. Uh yeah, let's check let's check that one out. Let's do it. Grim. Okay, so this is a Netflix show. Key. Oh oh key. This is a key. Okay. Clanad Cannon. Um Angel Beats. Oh dude. Yes. Okay, okay, I didn't, I didn't even know Key made, is this an original, this is an original, so this is like, so Angel Beats used to be an original, this is definitely Aniplex, 100%, I don't, there's no way in frick I could do it most likely, but, um, <laughs> but maybe, maybe we'll find a way, I don't know, I, I love, I'm a fan of Key, I love the visual novels, I played Clanid, I, 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 uh, I love visual novels in general, Key is amazing, so, one day during the last summer, it started with one wish. See, there's always wishing and... The God, and God descended. The day I became God. Do you, do you believe in God? Aniplex, God damn it. <laughs> I mean, uh, they just won't let us watch some some slice of life stuff, man. So she's saying she's God. Is that actually? Oh, so maybe there's multiples. See, this is the type of music I underrated. I need to get the cherry blossoms out, guys. See, this looks like it would be based off a visual novel normally, but it's because it's made by Key. They always have like the best characters though. They're great at having like a selection of, like a selection of girls and a selection of uh, people to interact with. What? Little boring every day, bothered by God. Why do I feel like the feels train will be on this? Like times a thousand. I'm already, I mean, it's, it's key. Of course it's gonna be, but that's what I thought. Why? Of course! Of course! To be continued next preview. Is there another preview? Then you're the god of all. Then you're the god of all. This is gonna be such mistranslation.
So is she saying that he's a god? God, good for Belgium? What the hell is it? What is this? <laughs> oh, that's a big F. Okay. Oh man. I, I it looks interesting to me, but I'm a fan of a I'm a fan of Clanid. I'm a fan of Key in general. So if it's not your the, the thing that you guys like, I understand. I'm guessing it's probably not voted. Oh, oh, you guys voted high, higher. Okay. Um, I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get it. We might have to wait on the. I, I I'm probably gonna do a weekly reaction to this. I just don't know how I'm gonna get it on YouTube because this is a show I want to watch on my own anyway. Oh my god, anything key, dude. Um, if it if it goes anywhere close to Angel Beats. Can you imagine, seriously, how good Angel Beats is? Like, oh, frick. Ooh, I like the, I like the music so far. So this is, okay, so this is made by, what's the studio? Yeah, that definitely, oh, boobs. Is that all I got? No, okay, that can't be the only thing I comment on the entire trailer. No, hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on. Okay, that, I get to re, I, I get to look at this. I, I can't. That cannot be the only thing I say in the entire reaction. Oh my god, that's that's horrible. Okay, so this animation does remind me. If you've seen Danganronpa three, the animation, uh, it very looks visually kind of like it. Um, why does she have a, what the hell is she doing with that knife? Um, looks like she can pack a punch. No, that's, that's too quick. I didn't get anything from this. All right. So this one looks a little bit more detailed. Looks like a futuristic, futuristic background. Goods. Definitely futuristic. Are those like targets? Why is the cat talking? I like the way they, they have the eyes here. Interesting. Brawler, hacker, so they got their own titles here. Doctor. Oh, okay, so the doctor's got the boobs. I'm getting Persona vibes here. I like this. Maybe it's just the way it's animated, but... Holy... Um, that person likes blood. What the fuck is happening? Uh, can we just go back? Um, they're just like, blah, blah, blah. Okay, here's all this futuristic stuff. There's an explosion. And then, uh, where, where the hell is it? Uh, let the body sit the floor. Yeah. What the hell happened here? And then we got, we got a person screaming red. Is this a psycho? Is, is this an assassin? Is this a, a killer? Um, somebody likes blood? Interesting. And getting slapped. Huh. I, I mean, there's brownie points already for the animation, uh, going off of, you know, Persona 5, or Persona, Danganronpa. I definitely get some, uh, some Persona vibes here from this trailer, especially from the second trailer. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, you say, Yukoko no Morality? Morality? Is that this one? Production IG? Huh. Did not remember with a modem to heal? Is this good subtitles? 
というものさガストロスクラブ美食家の金持ち連中が出入りしているところだな What? So old times. It's kind of got that, uh, what we were kind of seeing near the end of AOT season three there. Huh. Kind of that look. What the fuck? Okay, these subtitles are not correct. Uh, a lot, maybe some backstabbing, betrayal type stuff? Huh. Sixty-six years. So we're getting, we're getting, oh, that's why it feels like that. Yeah, okay. So, per, okay, I, production, yeah, production IG. Is that, was that, um, originally... Was production IG season one, season two of AOT? Uh, or of Attack on Titan? Is that why I was getting that? Yeah, those subtitles were horrible. Um, that's why I didn't really get much from it. I was just trying to get what I could get from the visuals. Yeah, it looks it looks very much old school, possibly, you know, uh, maybe a case, maybe detective work. It, lo it looked interesting. I like the animation. Yeah. Okay, so in the late 19th century, the British Empire has become a global power. Due to the strict class stratification, the average citizen has little chance of successfully rising up to the top, where the despicable nobility rules over them all. Where have we heard that before? <laughs> Muno no nana. Muno no nana. There's an elite school where only children with various abilities are gathered. What does that sound like? My hero! Ants? That girl is way too young to be- Okay, that's a mistranslation. What the fuck? Okay, I'm getting My Hero Academia vibes 100%. What? But instead of Deku, we get like a mini moon ripoff? Who would you prefer? Deku or mini moon ripoff? Huh. This is interesting though. What the? F okay. And we go to licking. Um, okay. So we got our own. <laughs> we got our own My Hero. Oh, there's a, there's a, be, more bad, badass Deku. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, wait. Did we just get a, 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 a badass Deku instead? They're like, we're going to correct this. We're going to make our own My Hero. And we're going to, and we're going to give, a, look at that. Didn't that look like Deku in the close up? Like, <laughs> We get a we get a better. Didn't that look like Deku? We're getting we're getting a better Deku. In the, <laughs> and there's an Ida. <laughs> hey man, I I wanted more spinoffs of my hero. Uh, oh man, anyone that's a fan of this is probably gonna kill me. But <laughs> I don't I don't know anything about it. I'm just kidding. I I it looks I anything that's like my hero it seems I love my hero Academia so. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's continue. Uh, so we got Bakugo. We got uh, what is that? Toga. <laughs> this seems a little bit more romantic, though. Wait, so. This looks a lot more rom. This looks more romantic to me than uh, definitely than to my hero. There's like freaking almost none, but but this looks like it has some, it's incorporating some romance. It's just I have no subtitles to go off of. I have garbage subtitles, so I'm just going off of what the image is. And um, I don't know. I, I just thought it was. I I am interested in anything, even if it's a show similar to my hero. Um, 
uh, it looks interesting to me. I, I wasn't, I, this is something I wouldn't even have clicked on. So I don't know. What do you guys think? My, my aunt academia. <laughs> I swear some of the some of these auto subtitles are just like like hey let's throw let's throw a name on there follow if you haven't followed subscribe to twitch if you haven't subscribed and you'd like to I'd appreciate seriously I'd appreciate it uh, but one thing I would one thing I would say um, is uh, if there is a trailer I missed if there's a show I missed before we before I tell you what I'm kind of leaning towards for the shows stay in because we're gonna talk about that for a second um uh i if you there's something i missed you go join the discord somebody can spam the link join the discord and let me know in the reaction in the right tab uh if i if i still need to react to something because i can add it to the overall uh video that i'm gonna make so i can do up to two shows at least one up to two for for seasonal so higarashi is at the top of my list that's the one I'm probably doing 100%. Um, I don't think it's Aniplex. I think we're in the clear on that one. So so for the second one is where it's going to be the choice. Now, um, let's, uh, let's gauge this here. So there's Jujutsu Kaisen, which I thought, I thought looked really good. You guys voted decent. Nobilis. Um, I don't even want to include this one made by Key uh the the freaking god one just because it's it's gonna get struck to hell uh, by aniplex so i don't know if i even want to include that okay screw it let's just watch danny phantom okay guys let's just watch danny phantom okay danny phantom reactions screw everything else yeah no i'm just kidding um but uh yeah I i'm leaning towards jujutsu kaisen um no Belize. Um, I want to do the Inuyasha one, but one, I think it's Aniplex, and two, I, I'm, I don't know if people would want to watch, I, it's a sequel, so, uh, but I'm leaning towards Higarashi and either Nobilis or Jujutsu Kaisen, that's where I'm at right now, 